Hey y'all, my name is Corey Ashton and welcome to another WordPress Wednesday. I'm going to give you a very quick run through of three of my favorite new tools online that will show you how to build out sitemaps or flowcharts and two really cool color palette generators. You're going to want to stick around for this because they are all in the budget of free. The first one I'll share with you is called Glue Maps. And this is a really cool tool to just on the fly work with a client, whether you're on the video call or with a phone, or if you just internally need to sit down for a minute and create a really quick site map. I love this tool. You can just start the project with home page and then think about all the different pages you want to have that kind of grows out from here about service. Right, and if you want to put another one underneath here, you can just do service, you know, one, two, three. Um, do another one, service two, right? You can add um, gallery, you know, you just build this out however you'd like and just keep on adding pages to it. Really grow it's very cool. So this is a very cool, totally free flowchart slash sitemap type of tool. But one of the other great powerful pieces of this is you can leave notes on here. So let's say on the gallery page we wanted to talk about having, oh, it's going to prompt me to save it really quickly, which is again totally for free. I'm not logged into an account. That's the really awesome part of this is I just get to come here and start tinkering right away. So I'll put the link to this in the description box below. But you can say we want a masonry gallery here. You can even add in the exact plugin name if you had a plugin that you wanted to highlight there, right? Then if you'd like to, you can go ahead and give it a different background color so that maybe you're assigning these now to um, you know, team members. So you can say that everybody um, has their own color and please pay attention to that when you're going in to work on those. Or maybe if you've finished building out one, you can assign a color. You can get really creative on how you'd like to use this tool though. Uh, very, very powerful tool. Then when you're finished up with everything here, you can go up to the top and click save and you can share it out so you can grab your link and share it to the client right away and or you can download it right again all totally for free and I've even used these throughout the entire project where we've had to come back to this link and reference it and it all still lives here so very cool cool tool called gluemaps.com g-l-o-o-m-a-p-s.com again I'll put the link in the description box below Let's check out the next one. Now we're going to talk about colors. We've all probably played around with a color calculator or a color palette generator, some sort of a tool. I've shared some of these with you before, but these are two new ones on my radar and I'm really enjoying these. So let's say we're going to come here and we're either going to put in our own color code, our hex color, or you can choose the color wheel and go find something that just makes you happy. And then you can start finding other colors that complement it well. This is great for helping a client come up with optional colors inside of the color palette, or maybe you're trying to find the right shade that just complements a brand's color and you want to bring in other colors into their website or into their marketing piece. You can do that here. So what's neat about this particular one is it gives us very unique colors in different parts of the shades that complement them. So complementary, if I click that, you're going to see immediately a complementary color. If I go here, it's going to be a monochromatic color. If I go here, analogous. If I go here, split complementary, triadic, and then tetradic. You can see that here. How cool is that, you guys? You can play around with this and it'll generate all of that and then you can click Get Color Scheme. This one, though, this website just makes me super happy. I could spend hours on here playing around. You can make a palette just in a couple of minutes. So I'm just going to click here and now I'm going to go in and now we're just going to look at these beautiful colors. We can play around with this by just clicking your space bar right here and it's just going to start showing you inspirational, beautiful colors. So as you're clicking through here, you can click and when you find one that really inspires you, you can start to play around with this. Let's say we really like this particular color here. This is Blue Munsell. Let's say I like that. I'm going to go ahead and lock that one in place and now I'm going to click my space bar again on my keyboard and watch it start to play around with other colors that complement that one. 
So like that's our anchor color basically and now I'm just going to play around and explore other colors. Loving this one. I'm really liking this bright orange over here called Flame. I'm going to drag that one over and start to just build this out a little bit. I'm going to hold on to that one now, lock it in place, and start to click through. Wow, this is fun. Look how beautiful and bright these are. I'm loving all of this. This is the exact color palette that I want to use now for my project. So now that I know this, I can either play around with other shades that live inside of here to just get a little bit of a different tone if I wanted to. Or I can go ahead and click Save Color to Favorites. Or I can also click and copy that hex code and go run and play with it inside of my website or design tools. Let's say you already had a color though that you wanted to create the color palette for. It's easily done by just coming here down to the bottom and click on one of those colors and paste in your own color code, right? So I already had a color code that I want to find complementary colors for. So I just pasted that in here. And now with that, I'm gonna click lock and then I'm gonna click my space bar and it will go find colors that complement with that shade of blue. How fun is that, y'all? Yeah, so now I like this one. I'm gonna bring this over, lock that, and play around. I wanna find a yellow that is just gonna, ah, oh, there you go. That's what I'm enjoying. Isn't that fun? The last thing I'll say about this really cool tool is if I wanted to share this color palette with a client, I can just grab the URL up here at the top that actually has the color codes inside of it. And so if I were to just send this link out to a client really quickly in an email saying, hey, check out these colors and play around with it, see if you like these, that link would come right to this page and display these exact color codes. Did I mention they are all in the budget of free? You guys, these are such cool tools. I'll put the links to them in the description box below. Also, I have another worksheet that has probably a hundred or more different resources for you. Some in the budget of free, some in the budget of premium, some with a free trial. I'll put the link to that Google Sheet in the description box below as well. Go check that out when you have time. Be sure to click like and subscribe and stick around with me. I'll see you again on another WordPress Wednesday. Bye everyone.